Hello YouTube, this is LoganWest250 here, and I, I'm going to show you a video like I promised on my last one. Uh, I'm going to show you my case knives. Um, I will, uh, you know, a lot of people won't like case knives, you know, I'm, so I'm going to go ahead and show them to you. Let me turn my camera, or my iPad, excuse me. I have to use my iPad. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Alright, let me get these out. Some of these don't have the original boxes, but, you know, it is what it is. I still got them. Alright, the first one here is a, um, let me get it here. First one here is a red bone trapper. Full size trapper, it's regular. Let me open the blade up. So, hold on a second. There's that blade. It's not shiny. And there's that blade. I like this one a lot. My pop. This is my most recent one I've got. Um, I got it for like a Christmas present for my grandparents. Nice and shiny. See, I don't technically use case knives. I just collect them. Oh crap! I collect them, you know. They're extremely beautiful. You know, I love these knives. Are like I would never sell one. People say, "Yeah, you're full of baloney," but I really won't do it. I won't sell them. Okay, uh, let's get out the next one. All right, I'm going to get these out. So. Alright, this one is the Rust Lock in gray. I love this knife. I'm actually gonna get a new one, maybe. It's gonna be in blue with the red, like the red shield on it, which I have the tiny tooth thick of that. And if you if you don't know what that is, I'll show you in a second. There's my Rust Lock. Yeah, gray bone. Definitely really cool. Nice blades, extremely sharp. Yeah. I'll, like I said, I wouldn't use them at all, but if I was in a dire life threatening situation, I would, if I had to, I absolutely would use them. Plus, well, if you collect them, there are two advantages. If you don't want to use them, you can collect them to put up, but if you have to, they're good cutting stuff or some stuff, so it's really sharp, so there's two advantages. Alright, let's move on to the next one, shall we? This one is a, I'll show you the box. Case Limited Edition, one of 3,000. It's a peanut in sea green. This video is going to be God knows how long, so. Uh, yes, this one I really, really, really love. I mean, this knife is just beautiful. See. Let me show you the blade. What it says, it'll say one three thousand on it. See, one of three thousand. Very nice. My papa has a peanut too, but it's not nearly as nice as this one. It is a silver script though, but so uh, it kind of sucks. I've always wanted a silver script, but you know, maybe the next knife I get will be one. <clears throat> sorry if I sorry if my voice goes out a little bit <clears throat> a little bit sick today. Not too much. Alright, let's go. Next one. We got the another trapper in rough black or gum buddy if you may recognize that somewhere. This one I got this and oh like near on my cousin's birthday we went to the flea market. It's a regular size trapper, you know. I'll show you one blade because it's the same thing as the other trapper. Same blade design, everything. <clears throat> I 
I like the Trapper a lot. I mean, well, it's not my favorite. I couldn't. I can't tell you the truth. I can't explain what my favorite would be. Uh, anyway, here's the Texas two pick. I'm getting. I may be getting the Rust Lock in this one. Okay, if I can pick it up. I don't like to handle them a lot. Cause I want to keep them good and shiny. <laughs> There it is, that color blue with that shield on. I want that in the rust lock. My uncle has one of these. It's an orange. Yeah. Nice little pocket knife, you know, carry in your pocket. You know, it, it's not my favorite, but it looks really cool. I mean, I may be getting the large one, too, so. The large one is kind of big. So. <clears throat> okay, here's my, uh. Medium stockman in bump in bone stag. Let me roll it out of here. I like to keep everything the way it was when I got it. Everything. This one's like my favorite one I have. It has three blades. I ain't going to go into a lot of detail about these and stuff. Here's the first blade. You know, people in there who don't like case knives, um, there's something the matter with you. You must be either you need to learn about them or something, or you want a cookie. Either one. It's just one little blade. Tough little booger. I would end up cutting myself, I guarantee it. Well, maybe not. There you go. Alright. Little bugger was tough. It's kind of tough to put back in there. This one right here is a really good knife. I, this, like I said, this is my favorite. You know? None of these beat this one. Well, that is until I get, if I do probably get my uh, blue stag bone handle. I mean, it's not bone, it's actually just the real stag stag. And it, it'll be my favorite. <laughs> um, but, you know, if I get it. Now, this one is a case pocket one. It's the only one I have. It's, it's, I love this one. I got this one the same day I got that peanut. That, that, that uh, limited edition. This is Harvest Orange. Very beautiful. Regular size muskrat. The tiny muskrat, I mean, this one was like fifty-seven dollars total, which is not that bad to me. But for well, fifty bucks for like seven dollars more, like less, you can get the tiny one, which is like freaking uh, like a half the size of this, or more or less probably. <clears throat> See, there you know, there's like the blade one and blade two and. They also caught the long one because it looks like the Texas long one. I like more than one blade on one on my knives, but I could care I couldn't care less. I mean, they're any case knife will do. Okay, okay. <laughs> any case knife will do. If somebody says, uh, you know, hey, you want a case knife? I'll be like, hey, uh, hey, yeah, I would. Yeah. People that don't have one, they don't understand how nice they feel. I mean, your hand. Yeah. Anyways, here's the Stockman, medium Stockman, in amber. Oh, love. This was like the one. This was like the first one I ever bought. Some of them, of these were given to me. This is the first one I actually ever went and took my money and paid for it. Ain't that beautiful? Uh, I'm going to open one blade because the other blades are the same except for this one. It's just a little different, not too much of a difference. Stock one is probably my favorite pattern, though. I've got like four or five stockmen, so. Oh, um, well, here's that one right there. was probably like number two, I think. So. Alright. <clears throat> now these, well, except for one of them, are have been used and they're old. So 
Okay, here's the last one. Well, well then here's just one. It's a simple little lock case. Ten, you can get these for like ten bucks at Lowe's or stuff like that. Case mini black one lock back. I mean, I would carry this one. That'd be my carry knife. I may carry it. So here's the other one. This one's a small stock one, and yeah, this is a synthetic handle. Let me get that open. It's the small. So there's a stock one number three. I really do like this one. I got this for my birthday, so I'm about to pop off. My other pop off. Thank you. He's a sweet old guy, you know. He's yeah. Yeah. Long stories and stuff. Man. Here's one that was carried by my my other papa, the one I live with here. This one's a whittle, whittler, I think. That's it's really worn old. I mean, this one's a dinosaur. Well, not really, but it looks. Case. Okay, kind of worn, but it says it. This one's probably from the 70s. You know, people back then, they didn't think it'd be, like, so collectible. People used them back then. People took pride in their work back then. They actually used some of these knives when they had to. I got well, two more knives to go, and then I'll, I'll let y'all go. This one I had a like had somebody tell me what the age was to this, and it's a by a professional knife. This one's been carried and used a little bit, but this one's from 1952. Case pen knife. It's actually if you listen, like well here, see it's been carried a lot while. If you'll listen to this, it's got good for springs for its age. You can see that. If you can see that. Case XX right there. Yeah. Okay. Got one more knife left, and I think, well, actually, I'm 100% sure this is the regular Stockman 1984 model. Yeah, yeah, I, I can't really tell. I think it's a synthetic handle, too, but. It's still cool. It was, this one here was actually my first case knife that I ever owned. Hey. Case. This was my grandfather's also. You can see it's a much bigger Stockman. This is the regular size Stockman, by the way. This is a nice little knife, you know. By the way, uh, this curved blade right here. Is for cutting meat, so like you need to like cut some stuff, you know. This right here be your meat, like meat cutting knife, and everything. Yeah, see, this is called a clip point, I think. This is your sheep's foot. And the meat blade, which I just showed you, that one is called a spay. Well, everybody, um, that's all on my case knives so far. If I ever get another one, I'll put it in. Like, you know, I won't do it in the whole video over again. I'll just show you. But uh, that's all I have for right now. And um, I hope you do guys do subscribe and everything, you know. And, uh watch some of my cousin's videos J.R. Mueller 2000 it was uh, his friends but he gave it to him and then he started his own another one his real name is uh, Zach if you want to be his friend on Next Watch Live it's Boone Pride 45 I'm Logan West 117 and uh, well I will see you guys in the next video check you later